Hey, it's Erin from Hardy Home Reno. Today we're going to be making the simple and functional wall shelf. It's an easy project that will just take you an hour or two in the afternoon. Let's get started. Here is a list of the tools you will need for this project. A miter saw or circular saw, a drill, countersink drill bits if you have them. If not, just various drill bit sizes will do. Here's a list of the materials you'll need for this project. Two 1x6x8, one 1x4x4, one package of one and a fourth inch wood screws, wood filler, various grits of sandpaper, and your finisher stain. Step one, make your cuts. Here is the list of the cuts that you will need to make for this project. Make sure you measure twice and cut once. For your one by six by eight board, you're going to make two cuts at 24 inches, two cuts at 36 inches, and six cuts at 10 inches. On your one by four by four board, you're gonna make four cuts at 10 inches. These will be your small dividers. Step two, assemble the top and bottom shelves. You will need to take your 24 inch board and attach it to your 10 inch boards. The 10 inch boards will be your side pieces. Make sure you pre-drill and countersink your holes. You will then attach with one and a fourth inch wood screws. Once you have both sides attached, you need to attach your one by four divider. Measure 12 inches on the 24 inch board and that's where your holes should be drilled. Again, pre-drill and countersink your holes. Step three, assemble the middle shelf. Attach the side 10 inch boards the same way you did to the top and bottom shelf. Now measure and pre-drill for the smaller dividers. The smaller dividers should be placed at 12 inches and 24 inches on your 36 inch board. Step four, attach your bottom shelf to your middle shelf. Now take the middle shelf and measure the halfway point at one and a half feet. That's where your small divider of your bottom shelf will be placed. Measure to make sure the bottom shelf is centered on the middle shelf, approximately six inches on either side. Now flip the shelf over so the bottom shelf is on the ground. Pre-drill and countersink your holes and then attach with one and fourth inch wood screws. Step five, complete the middle shelf. Now you will take the second 36 inch board and put it on top of the middle shelf. Center it, pre-drill and countersink your holes and then attach with one and a fourth inch wood screws. Now is a good time to measure to make sure all of your shelves are evenly spaced apart. Step six, attach your top shelf. Attach your top shelf the same way you did your bottom shelf. Center it on your middle shelf, which is your 36 inch board. Flip the shelf around so the top shelf is on the ground. Pre-drill and countersink all of your holes and then attach with wood screws. Step seven, fill in all your holes with wood filler, sand, and finish your project. Just like that, your project is complete. 